Hi friends, what's up? This is RK from 360 Reader. I'm back again with a cool tip that can let you turn a voice memo into an iPhone ringtone. Just in case you are fond of funky or quirky ringtone, you would really appreciate this hack. So if you are all set to give a personal touch to your ringtone, let's dive right in to get going. Before getting started, make sure you have subscribed our YouTube channel and hit the bell icon so that you won't miss any update from 360 Reader. First off, make sure to download GarageBand from the App Store as it is required to turn a voice memo into an iPhone ringtone. After that, you have to launch Voice Memos app on your iPhone and then tap on the recording that you want to set as your ringtone and hit the triple dot icon for more options. It will open the iOS share set. After that, you have to choose save to files and then save the audio recording to the files app. Next, launch the GarageBand app on your iOS device and then choose an instrument. You have a lot of instruments to choose from, so select the one that catches your eyes. In this video, I'm going to choose the keyboard as it is my favorite instrument. After opening the instrument, tap on the project icon and then hit the loop icon located at the top right corner to open your audio recording. Ensure that the file section is selected and then tap on the browse items from the files app. Now the files you know, directory will open in the GarageBand app. Next you have to tap on the audio recording which you want to use. After that you need to long press the file name to open it in the project menu within the GarageBand app. After that you have to drop the file as the second track and then tap on this track. Then you have to, you know, drag the ends to trim the audio recording. You can play it back to find out whether or not it is up to the mark. Oh yes, there is also an option to disable the annoying metronome by hitting the icon located to the right of the record icon. After you have fine-tuned your recording, ensure that it is under 40 seconds in length. Then you have to tap on the download arrow icon at the top left corner and choose my songs. After that, the guys band project will appear under the recents as my song. Then you have to touch and hold it to access more options. Next up, tap on share in the menu. Then you have to select a ringtone in order to export it as an iPhone ringtone on your device. Then you have to give it a nice name. After that you have to hit the export option located at the top right corner of the screen. Once the export is successful, you need to select Use Sound as it will let you set the default ringtone right within the GarageBand app. Finally, you can set it as your default ringtone or text tone as per your needs. Moreover, you can also assign this sound to a specific contact. It's worth mentioning that you will be able to add it to the list of existing ringtones as well if you don't want to use it now to do it all you have to do is hit the done button to confirm that's pretty much it that's how you can convert voice memos into iphone ringtones now that you know the trick get the most out of it to create an out of the box ringtone for your iphone if you have found this hack worth giving a shot do like and share it and i'll see you in the next video with more such cool tips till then have a wonderful time bye bye